Alright everyone, welcome to MTV Cribs. Come check out my pad. So as you can see in here, this is the living room. This is where we, you know, like, sit around and watch TV and shit, you know. If I had a TV and shit. Yeah, this here in my workshop, because you know, every man's gotta have a workshop. You know, I keep my wrenches, my screwdriver, my other stuff, like, man stuff. I'll, I'll fix, I'll fix your TV. Couple caps. I really need money. I need furniture. Please? Back here is what I call the the chill area. And you know, you can come back here, fucking chill out, maybe uh sit here and go through this chest. I don't know what's in there, fucking clothes or something, I don't know. You can uh you can uh, play with this shopping cart here. Uh we, we got a table back here with an umbrella, you know, keep the sun rays on you, you know, except we're, in, we're inside. Covers you from roof rays, I guess. Uh, you, you can have a new cola, you know, a new cola machine back here, you know. Stuff. God, I'm poor. It also happens to lead to my back door, which is where I like to take chicks through. To let them know that I'm about to go visit their back door. My wife was killed when she was frozen. Hey, you can see right here, we got some uh, high quality stairs. They uh, they lead up to the place where the magic happens. You know, the magic. Let me show you. Alright, so here we have the magic room, the master suite. You know, where I gets downs. I, I mean, where I. I I don't, I don't have dams. This is where I sleep though. You see we got a big old bed here. You know, it's good enough to fit like so many people. Like one person tops. I'm too big for it. I also have a dresser over here. This is where I keep all my clothes. You know, my fly duds when I want to look sick as shit. You know, for all them fly ass honeys that be into this swag ass body here. Y'all haven't seen anything yet. This is the best part of the house. This this thing right here, best area of the house. Let me show you, let me show you. We gotta go up this ladder here. Oh yeah, you know your boy has a fucking Airstream on top of his house. An Airstream, an actual motherfucking Airstream as a second, th now third, it's on my house. It's on my house. And it ain't just no normal Airstream. No, it's an Airstream that also acts as a deck. I have a fucking bathtub up here, shit's jacuzzi, get them jets going, you know, so big, so big, you can fit so many bitches up in here, like, one person. I also got a dog house up here, you know, for my little pupper, I, ha I had this dog, his name Dog Meat, but uh, I don't know where I put him, I haven't seen him in like four or five days. But I have this dope ass dog house for him, so I mean, it should be fucking good to go, he should be here already. Where the fuck is my dog, man? Worried about him. Hey, y'all best believe that I have the barbecue up here. Can't be out on this deck on a nice sunny day without throwing some fucking rad roach meat onto that bitch. Sauteing that shit up real good. Dump some of that sauce on it. Man, so good. I miss cheeseburgers. Alright, MTV. You seen the magic room. You saw the chill area. You saw the living room. The fucking grill, bathtub. You saw the dog house. So now it's time for you guys to fucking leave, because I get to get my chill on. So, uh, I'll be seeing you next time, MTV Cribs. Next time. Next time. No, where are you going? Don't go. Please don't go. No, I'm so lonely. No, come back. Come back. Just stay with me for a little while. Please. Please, I'm tender. We can cuddle. You're gonna check what's going on here, man. Cool. I always stay lit. We 
so got small thirsty. Arm. Long arm. Doctor says I can't drink arm. liquor no more. Cola. Need a new Coca Cola. <laughs> you don't need a new Coca Cola, you fucking junkie. What you need is a bullet to the head. No oh, fuck. I've made my mistakes! Got nowhere to run! My life is fading away! This rain is pouring, the old bitch is snoring. Oh, hey, what's up? Tofu! What have you done with the real life? Where's my brother? I swear, I'm not a simp. Don't shoot, for God's sakes, we're family! We're Put the family. Gun down now! He's a Sith! He'll kill us all! Kyle, no! Okay. Yo! There are no Kyle got fucked up! That's like shit. Hey. Yep. What happened? I'm, I'm not a Sith, thing. I told him. I, I kept telling him. Why didn't he listen to me? I, uh... I need him. I need you to step away, Scabber. There a problem, officer? Oh, don't even start with me. I got a dead body in the middle of the damn street. Now follow orders and get out of here. Oh, we gonna have a problem? We gonna have a problem? I think we gonna have a fucking problem! I see you. You know what else I see? Still for? It's fucking dead body. To your own damn Do something about this, huh? Ooh, Kyle! I've come back to haunt you, you synth bitch! Ooh! Hey, look, I put his head back on. Ooh! Here. Fucking Nagasaki or whatever the hell your name is. Put this in your soup. Are you a synth? <clears throat> Don't bother, pal. I ain't seen nothing. I ain't heard nothing. You sure about that? Some tells me you're lying. I'll believe you though. So we finally got to Diamond City. Got Diamond City. It's cool. We got here. After some difficulties. How could this happen to me? How could this happen to me? How could this happen to me? We had a lot of difficulties getting to Diamond City, and it made me realize one thing. I'm not good at survival. <clears throat> I like to die. Well, I don't like to die, but I tend to die. I die a lot. So with that, I decided to turn survival off. I'm not good at it, and it's going to take forever to progress through the game, so I just decided, fuck it. Left it on hard, though, so should be kind of interesting. Now, today, we're going to go talk to Nick Valentine, I believe. See what's up with him. Man, it's getting kind of foggy. A little bit gross. By the way, as you did see, I bought a house. Kind of had to. Oh, wow. you're tall. And you're a fucking asshole. Go away. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I got to touch your booty, boy. Keep running. Touch. Oh, you lost out of such funny clothes. Say it again. Say it again. Say it again! Come back here! I'm not done with you! Hey, nice fan. Get the fuck out of here. Something wrong? Another stray coming in from the rain. Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. I didn't come here to get brushed off. Well, you can take a seat and wait for the next Armageddon. Because the detective ain't coming back. He's gone missing. Picture on milk carton time? Surely you meant to leave that rubbish where you found it. Excuse me, Codsworth? You got a fucking problem? 
Bad robot. Well, it looks like we're going to find a fucking detective because he can't detect his way out of a fucking cardboard box! And off we go. You shoot people in, sir? My dad says outside to shoot people. I'll fucking shoot you, Pete! Alright, where the fuck are we going? All the way the fuck up here! <sighs> Them some good killings! Ah! Uh, there's a bunch of super mutants here. I don't want to get fucking caught by them. What's that? It's nothing! Leave me alone! What? Who's there? No one! Just keep doing what you're doing. Ouch. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. Isn't this where Swan is? Yeah, I'm not fucking around with this guy right now. Let's go save the detective, because he can't save himself. Mike! Reset up. Thing. Okay, there. That's a little better. Isn't it? Oh, why well, yes it is, Cody. You sure do know what you're doing. I guess. Or at least you think you do. Fucking idiot. I didn't want it to end this way! <laughs> DIE! Yeah, you player. fucking asshole! <laughs> Give me back my goddamn detective! My son is missing! What? Where the fuck are you going? The cigarette machine does not want to be your friend. Bad robot. Just gotta wash my hands. Oh. 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 You are. You are fucking disgusting. That body has been ravaged. Let's go save the detective and shoot people in the face. How much do I weigh? Dead. Oh, that was a trap. That's clever. I really feel like I've lost some weight lately. I've been exercising. Don't you know? Wh where are you, Codsworth? Well, whatever. I'll compliment myself. Look, I only weigh... Oh, that's some bullshit. That's some bullshit. I do not weigh that much. Will you? Do you promise? Are you gonna take me to Disneyland? These bullets whizzing through my body sure don't feel like Disneyland. Nice. Hey, that's pretty good. Oh, I shot him in the dick, I think. You know, could have been a lot nicer about all this, guys. Like, I didn't really want to have to kill you. Just looking for some dude to help me find my son. But no. No. We had to get all fucking physical, didn't we? Didn't we? Tyrone. I'm not gonna desecrate your body because that'd be considered a hate crime. You, on the other hand, you're not even a color. Why can't we just be friends? Oh, Jesus. Sorry if that was your partner. He was shooting at me, though. Oh, yeah. They're definitely alive. Like, this guy. This guy right here. Alive. Like, hey, buddy. How you doing? Oh, I'm doing good. Just laying here. Alive. I shot you. Why didn't your head blow? 
Oh, sh shit, wrong button. Wrong, no, no. <laughs> Oh, it's okay. Ba doop ba doop, fall door, ba doop ba doop, go inside. A bolt. Down here? Yes. Peekaboo! Ah! Got him! You know, kind of feeling wardrobe change. Much better. So I got a question. Why the hell would anyone build a vault out of a subway station? This place is like the opposite of airtight. Because they weren't planning to use it, you moron. We used to pull this kind of gun all the time back before the war. Get a bunch of union boys to work some construction job that would go nowhere. <laughs> Keep everyone on payroll. Huh? Oh, shit. Teach you to be spreading our fucking secrets. My name is Agent Chavez Caution, sir. from the fucking FDA. Wow. Oh, hey. Bye. Here, I think, I think you're missing this. Let me just, let me just get that. Right there. Talking, meathead. It'll give Skinny Malone more time to think about how he's gonna bump you off. Don't give me that crap. What? <coughs> Peekaboo! You're dead. I crack myself up sometimes. Boop boop boop. Gonna save the boop 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 detective. Hey, who you are, but we got three minutes before they realize muscles for brains ain't coming back. Get this door open. You could have asked me nicely. So I don't think so. I'm out of here. See ya. I don't need to find my son. I don't if care about him. Nine hundred ninety-eight. That's a long fucking ways away. They better be close to that. Ah, uh -huh, my knight in shining armor. You're fucking Question creepy. Is, why does he come all this way? Risk life and limb. An old private eye. I need you to find someone, but it's complicated. I don't exactly know where they could be or how long they've been gone. Well, I've done jobs with less. Somehow nice and simple never makes it onto the menu in my world. I've been cooped up in here for weeks. Turns out the runaway daughter I came here to find wasn't kidnapped. She's Skinny Malone's new flame. And she's got a mean streak. Anyway, you got troubles, and I'm glad to help. But now ain't the time. Let's blow this joint. Then we'll talk. All right there, buddy. Your creepy-ass eyes and robo-pieces. crew here used to be small time. There we go. A bobblehead. Hold up, I hear some of them. <laughs> there they are. They won't be bothering anybody now. That was kind of the plan there, Nick. Oh, that was different. Hey, Nick. Got you a present there, buddy. Oh. Sorry, I lost your present. You filthy animal. Did the fucking wall just kill me? Mahogany. 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 Oh, I was shooting the wrong person. Sorry, Nick, you look just like him. Fucking ugly. 
I'm gonna hit this with it. Fight back, stupid! That's pretty good. Oh, shoot him in the fucking face! Those shoot up my guys? You have any idea how much this is gonna set me back? I wouldn't be here if it weren't for your two timing game, Skinny. You ought to tell her to write home more often. Oh, poor little Valentine. Ashamed you got beat up by a girl. I told you we should have just killed him! But then you had to get all sentimental. All that stupid crap about the old times. Darla, I'm Man, Darla this. sounds like she's Skinny just a bit off the fucking hinge. Oh, yeah? Then what's this guy doing here, huh? Skinny's no good for you, Darla. You put a bullet in him, and I just might let you go. Wow. You're... You're a bad boy, ain't you? Yeah, girl. Sorry, babe, but this is the end for us. And for you. You double-crossing mall. Teach me to fall for a great set of legs. Oh, <laughs> ah! Ah! Why am I dying? Oh, yeah? Then what's this guy doing here, huh? Valentine must have brought him here to rub us all out. I'm here to kill you and fuck your corpse. I'm king of the castle, you hear me? And I ain't letting some private dick shut us down now that I finally got it up. <laughs> that works. Not so much for Skinny Malone. I think he's lighter or heavier with all those holes in it. Well, the bullets probably add a few ounces. Good night, sweet prince. Here's to all the old days. You are fucking dark, I'm Nick. A conversation with Darla's parents when I tell them their daughter bit the big one. Well, at least the case is closed. Let's get out of here. It's a service ladder that should take us right to the surface. Damn. I mean, I know you're dead, but. Hmm. Smack that booty. Nick, baby, where'd you go? In behind? Fat, takes me a while to run. Look at that Commonwealth sky. Never thought anything so naturally ominous could end up looking so inviting. Thanks for getting me out. How did you know where to find me, anyway? How many people knew where I went? That's not important. All right, wise guy, keep your secrets. Lead the way, Nick. All right, let's move fast. Follow me. <laughs> I don't like robots. I don't like mannequins either.